You no doubt have heard. Fort Locke has fallen. Nasher has summoned you. You are to report to Castle Never at once, and only you. Your companions are to wait here. Good. Ride fast for Neverwinter, and when you arrive, simply go straight to the castle. Nasher will be expecting you. Oh, uh, oh, it's you, the captain of Crossroad Keep. I've been waiting for some time. I bring you greetings from Lusk. Not now. The captain has urgent business. Whatever you need from him can wait till he returns from Neverwinter. Uh, yes, well, I'll, I'll be um, waiting anxiously for your return. There is a growing darkness to the south, and Crossroad Keep is our best hope to stopping the army of the King of Shadows from reaching Neverwinter. Your keep will play a great role in the war to come. We are still awaiting word from the defense of Fort Locke, but we fear the worst. But the tidings are not all ill. Lord Nasher has prepared something for you, for all your efforts on behalf of Neverwinter. Here, these are yours to wear and to wear proudly. It is the garb of knighthood, and soon Nasher shall make you a true knight in his service. As the days grow darker, the need for heroes grows greater. And Lord Nasher wants to recognize you as one of our finest. It is you who have built the keep into the force that it is. It is your name that is echoed on the lips of the men and women here. Even Sand has been known to say a kind word or two about you. What you wear is merely a cloak until that time. But you will find it carries with it special enchantments you may find helpful. Some of the finest mages and weavers of Neverwinter have crafted these cloaks. They should afford you some measure of protection while wearing them. The rest you will discover for yourself. The ceremony will take place in the Great Hall. We have gathered together many nobles from all over Neverwinter. Come now, let us make our way to the antechamber outside the Great Hall. Lord Nasher awaits. Your companions, the people you have assembled in Crossroad Keep believe in you, and through you believe in Neverwinter. It is no small thing you have done here. Is that... Gods, it's the ancient alarm! I never thought I'd live to see this day. We are under attack! <laughs> they are here for Nasser. We must get to him at once. Become one with eternity.
leave me behind. a more defensible location. There is a guard room in the hall round the corner from here. There we can make our stand. To the guard room. Follow me. Everyone into the guard room now, quickly! The castle has been sealed. It is part of the ancient defenses of the castle should it ever be attacked, something we thought would never happen. Unfortunately, it has cut us off from Lord Nasher. You must get to him or all is lost. Good. Look behind the tapestries in the hall. One of them should hold an entrance to Neverneath, the chambers beneath Castle Never. Neverneath has always been closed to us, but it is said when the castle is in danger, a path opens for defenders of Neverwinter. Make your way to Lord Nasher's side. We will try to be there as soon as the defenses are lifted.
Strike true!
Assassins? They sent assassins here. So this is how this enemy fights with shadows instead of cold steel. I am unharmed, though I should see to the men stationed on the walls and in the keep. This King of Shadows, his forces are powerful. Is that the Rod of Never you carry? Let me see it. I had heard the Rod rested below, but none have been able to enter Lord Hallowes' tomb. It seems the ancient alarms of the keep open the way. With this rod, I should be able to open some of Castle Never's oldest secrets. It seems some good has come from this surprise attack. I think this enemy fears to face us on the field of battle. He fears to face Neverwinter and all its knights. And that now includes you. You have earned this through your deeds. The title of Knight in Service to Neverwinter. Don't thank me yet. I haven't given you your orders. My lord, there are certain rights for inducting knights that must be... Naval. I knighted you at Redfellow's Watch in the mud with orcs surrounding us. Ceremonies can wait. Now bow and be knighted. A knight of Neverwinter is entitled to land, a keep, and forces, my lord. And he shall have them. But you, Knight Captain, and your efforts here, you have served Neverwinter beyond the call of duty, risking your life not once, but several times without hesitation. If there is anything that I think will be the light against this shadow that comes against us, it is you and the fortress I have granted you. I offer you an honor to become one of the Neverwinter Nine, the protectors of Neverwinter, the surrounding lands, and most importantly, its people. Very well. For your efforts at Crossroad Keep and your battles against these minions of shadow, I convey upon you the mantle of one of the Neverwinter Nine. And a much deserved title it is, Knight Captain. We welcome you into our ranks. But on to the matters at hand. You have done more to halt this beast in advance than any of my knights. When he strikes, you are there to counter it, but that is no longer enough. I am tired of waiting for this enemy to strike. I want you to find this King of Shadows. I want this beast to answer for the blood of every guardsman slain here tonight. If he crosses Neverwinter again, I want it to be the last time. To the servants of Neverwinter, here before me. All fighting men of Neverwinter must take to the field to face this foe. You have seen one of its servants, and as terrible as it may seem, it can be beaten, and so can our enemy. You must spread the word. Help your neighbors to evacuate their homes as we fortify the walls of Neverwinter. We cannot allow our people to be placed in jeopardy. We alone must face this threat. Go now and do what you can to prepare for the coming battle. And so a strategy must be formed. These Reavers, whatever these things of shadow are, there is no way the Grey Cloaks can fight them. If our enemies cannot be killed, they are pawns only. Powerful, yes, but not the true threat. The base that the enemy is striking from. If we cannot reach it, then we cannot take the battle to him. He can send his soldiers out without fear of counterattack, and there is nothing we can do but fall back. Even if these ruins could be reached, we still need more men. Between the plague and the war with Luskin... Then we will gather more men, but not just men. This enemy threatens not just us. We must make allies, and we must do so quickly. There is much to be done, I think. But I have faith in your efforts. It is said that the captain of Crossroad Keep is the lord of the manor in all but name. Now, I've named it for you, but it will not be enough. I am in need of answers, information, and as many soldiers as you can gather. I need to know how these Shadow Reavers can be killed, and how I can reach their master. And we need allies wherever they can be found, from all the races, all the peoples. This is not our war, it is theirs, whether they know it or not. There are old alliances that Neverwinter had years ago, in the days before I took the crown. I need you to reforge these alliances. Without more troops, this battle is already lost. A clan of dwarves, the Iron Fist clan, is said to have returned to their clan hold in Old Owl World. 
after the pass was liberated by Neverwinter. Perhaps they would be grateful enough to aid us in the coming battle. But we cannot count on them being able to join the effort. And even so, there is still the matter of the King of Shadows. The Lizard Men of the Mare? What of them? Will they fight for us? I do not think any Lizard Man would be quick to come to the aid of Neverwinter, even if we could speak with them. Yet, if they would join us, they know the terrain, perhaps even know about more of the movements of the King of Shadows through the Mere. If you think you can contact them and persuade them to help us, then may the gods smile upon you. Such allies might give us the edge we need. We asked the enemy. We still have some of the Arcade Brotherhood in our dungeons. Let them provide us with answers. See to it. My lord, I believe Aldenon is already searching for a means by which we can reach the King of Shadows' stronghold. Half the task will be him finding it, and the second task will be trying to understand him when he explains it. Then I shall leave you both to these preparations. I must attend to the troops and the war effort. You are to attend to the King of Shadows. Of all our knights, no one has a greater chance of finding his weakness than you. I shall gather our forces, but you must show me where we must march. Return to Crossroad Keep and begin preparations. Naval will go to assist you, and he will remain there as long as needed. Now, go! We heard about what happened at Castle Never. The attack. It's good to see you're all right. To attack Castle Never? The King of Shadows? Garius? Oh, they're getting bold, they are. So, did you get any gold along with the knighting ceremony? I mean, not that you'd carry it with you, since I already checked your pockets in your bags. What efforts are being made in the war? Will Nasher commit his forces? And what of Waterdeep and the Lord's Alliance? Know that word of all of this has traveled before the Kalak Cha. Our duty is to carry the battle to the King of Shadows, his servants, and gather others who feel the same. No, that will not be easy. Every time they are struck down, they reform. The only losses in battle with them will be ours. There must be a way. Evil always has a weakness. We just have to find it. Well, that's the trick, isn't it? The thing is, how long do you look and where? Pardon me, but sometimes these things come to you. I mean, we can't be the only ones the Reavers have threatened or hurt. We already have crossed paths with a bunch of allies and people and sorcerers and sages we never even knew before. And we did much of that through serendipity. So have a little faith. Maybe an answer will come to us. Know that this may be the best we can hope for. We should search, but the problem of the Reavers may be one that only time can aid us with. Alliances are made to be broken. If agreed to at all, good luck trying to get anyone to join our side in these times. Clan Iron Fist will help. They may take some convincing, but they wouldn't back down from a fight if they thought it was just. The lizard folk should not be ignored. They once made their homes in the Mare, and the King of Shadows has driven them out. The lizards? Their history with settlements along the Mare is bloody. But they are fiercely territorial and are likely to hate the King of Shadows even more. And we could look at last for the Wendersnaven! Oh, gods! No, they're not gods. They're the Wendersnaven. They exist, even if you can't see them with the eye or touch them. They see all, know all, and have incredible powers. If they are on our side, we have a good chance of winning. Oh, really? And how do we find something you can't see or touch and most likely exists in your head? There's two sages at Port Last that are said to know something of the Wendestaven. We could ask them. Then it seems we have a number of roads open to us and an army to build. The claimed lands kill all life that enter it. We wouldn't be able to reach the King of Shadows in time. The movement through the mare is never swift even in the best of times. If there's a path at all, we'd still need to know where we were going. And even then, we'd probably die getting there. I don't think there's an easy path. As much as I hate to say it, I think we should ask Aldenon for advice on this. <laughs> 